You need about three and a half. Coker pressured. Flips it far side and DJ or OJ Howard. The tight end is wide open and rumbling free down inside the 30. Lane Kiffin with a good call against the pressure, Kirk. A great call on third down. They brought B.J. Goodson on the blitz. You see him right here. Howard's hiding. Nobody picks him up coming out of the backfield, and it opened it up for an easy throw for Coker. And the tie do this after a big pass play. Two by two, look. They fake it to Henry. Coker loops it downfield. Howard is wide open, and the tight end will waltz to the end zone. To wait and be patient, but when I get a chance, I got to make sure I take it. He sure took it here. Clemson busts the coverage. Give Jake Coker a lot of credit for being able to recognize that. And here's a look at the play from the AT&T pylon cam as O.J. Howard takes it into the end zone, stays it back. They move the pocket, and Howard is wide open again. The tight end rumbling across the 35. Made a couple of big plays tonight. Boy, what a call to be able to get Kevin Dodd, who's had a big night, collapsing down. They go naked around him. He's collapsed so much and had so much success. Instead, they work around him, misdirection against him. Spelling Henry now, and Coker looks downfield again. Wide open is Howard for his second long touchdown tonight, and the Tide reclaim the lead. You've got confusion and coverage here from Alabama's John Howard right here. He's going to slide down. Green settles in, and nobody gets back with Howard. It's the second time we've seen the tight end get behind coverage. You don't know from sitting up here if it's T.J. Green, the safety, or the play. They flip it to Howard, and the big man gets the edge and gets trembling again. O.J. Howard! Roping and shut out inside the 20. Pardon the pun, but Howard has been the rock tonight for Bama. Mackenzie Alexander not being in this game. Baker misses the tackle right there. He gets out leveraged, doesn't get to the outside, and force Howard back in where the rest of the Clemson defense would have had the first time since Mackenzie Alexander has gone out of the game that Alabama's been able to take advantage of Adrian Baker, and it was at the most crucial moment in the game. We just.